boxing to me is like a way of motivation and getting out the hood. Being a kid growing up in Chicago, you see a lot of drug dealing, game banging, shootouts. But we're in the city showing kids like, this isn't just a bubble and this is how everything gets in life. You gotta have a belief in yourself that you can see more than this, you can be better than this. This great big story is made possible by The Shy on Showtime. My name is Sally Hazelgrove, and I am the founder and executive director of Restoring the Path Crushers Club. In 2000, I was living in Chicago, and I started studying gangs and interviewing gang members. And I asked them in 2004, what's something that would get you off the block? And boxing was their number one answer. From hearing their stories, I started to formulate a vision. And in March of 2013, I opened Crusher's Club. Crusher's Club is a place where youth come as an alternative to gangs and as a way to terminate off a of juvenile probation. Good. Take your time. It took me a month. It took me like two weeks to a month to get this. You learn in one day. Good. Look at that. Since opening our doors, we've seen over 500 youth. They can let down their guard. They can be young men. They can empathize with each other. They can be funny. I tell all of them, it's your job to save all the children. I'm here to empower you and for you to lead because they are the change makers. I didn't have no easy experience being in Chicago. Like, when I was six, I seen my daddy get shot right in front of me. I had so many close friends to me, and like, friends just in general that just getting killed off gun violence. After a while, like for me, death just became normal. I started coming to Crush Club when I was nine years old. Ever since then, I just been boxing. I had to look at the bigger picture. Instead of just seeing the streets and being enticed by what you see every day. Because I see drug dealers, boosters, people selling weed, people selling crack, all that stuff entice you to do that, to be, to be that type of person. But I know I'm bigger than the streets. The boxing ring was like almost like my guidance and my therapy. Anytime I had an issue, anytime I had a problem, anytime I felt some type of way, as soon as I stepped in, foot in Crest Club, I felt like I was on top. We've had a lot of success at Crusher's Club. I've seen young men that were on the street shooting now come to me and say, I no longer gangbang, and I put down my gun. These are not hardened criminals, and we're going to fight for them pretty much to our dying breath. Look at all these pictures, all these kids. Like, you're not just thinking about yourself, you're thinking about the kids. You're a kid, you can still have a kid life. You can still do the basic things that any other kid in any other city want to do. You feel that family environment and that family vibe when you're in here. I know what I'm doing, I wouldn't be the same person if it wasn't for Crush Club or for boxing. I feel like this ain't even like my real beginning because I got way more to go. It's just like the tip of the iceberg.